Okay, so these are about at 20 yards. You're actually closer to 15 right there. I'll walk it, I'll walk it up though. Oh, I was counting feet not that uh, yard. Chris measuring the yards. Fifteen feet? Fifteen yards. We'll take fifteen yards. These are the two volunteers that have agreed to test if a slug punches a hole in the target or not. We are going to test first on this homemade target. It's a it's an Amazon box with uh, a rifle target taped on it. Let's give about five shots and see how we do. If this distance, your deer is dead. <laughs> oh wow. Uh, just look at the holes the three slugs made. And these are one ounce slugs. So I think now it's time for the pumpkins. I'll take a couple more shots at that. And okay. Then, and then without doing anything else, let's yeah. go over the pumpkin. Got it, we'll do that. That puppet got more than scared. <laughs> that puppet got to go against oh, that puppet. Emergency okay. room visit. Let's see. Here. Okay, this one is safe. What about this one? So. You just clipped it. Just clipped it. Could it be that the slug's inside it? I don't think so. No, no, it, it, it had to have just grazed it. Yeah. So it did about, what would you say, about two inches of a hole? Yeah, but it, it, but it just it came like yeah. the slug had just, just nicked it. There's a small piece. That's the wad. That's the wad. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Okay. We're gonna try and hit them again and see if we can get the slugs to pass through them. <laughs> this one should. Oh my gosh! Massive. Epic destruction. Well, we had two pumpkins, now we have three. Yeah, now you, well, I don't know. Now we got five. <laughs> Finally. Oh, wow. Yeah, that one's got a serious headache right there. So, I think it hit dead center. I think. Yeah. And then it did pass through. So it entered. And that's that's how it was weakened already because of where it got picked. Oh clipped. yeah, that's true. Now you have one victim left. You have one victim left, and this is the this is the other piece. I wish we could do some kind of surgery to fix it back, but oh, back poor guy. And that's about two and a half feet that we're uh, about to see if we hit this pumpkin, and if we do, what happens? Yeah, here's it two and a half feet, and we'll take it up. You hit that one. <laughs> Let's go see what happens. Okay, you see, I'm seeing a lot of uh, gunpowder residue. The ward that was stuck in the pumpkin right here. 
but both her pumpkins are down and uh, I think definitely a slug will go through yeah. any target. We tested out the, the cardboard box and the pumpkins. <laughs> 